Hello and welcome back to, I think, the third episode. Uh, yeah, we are just waiting for our colony ship to colonize the system Reman to expand our empire. Um, yeah, we have started to get better diplomatic relationships with our neighbors that we do not have an early war and engaged problems which have come with this war. It's great due to the fact that I now have a counselor which gives me a bonus on the cost of a mining station. I will also build the mining station for energy and it is necessary to expand this resource. On the surface of my planet I am working at the moment I think to clear this area updated. to set up a further power plant which give a base bonus of plus two. How long it will take till my colony ship is ready? 205 days. Research complete. No, negative. New research. Great. The power plants can be updated, and I will also go for the power hub, which gives also a plus 10 bonus. Ratimra Gisha. Who's that? Looks great that my scientist got this trait so I can use it on a later stage of the game. Power plant, I think I will build up here. Plus 10 bonus. So, 200 days roundabout left until my colony ship is built. What are my first fleet doing? It's cruising around, exploring new empires. Construction complete. I will go Anomaly off. found. 45% is a bit too high. I will gather first more information about the galaxy until I start. Situation log updated. To research the language. So. Carved upgrade science lab. Fleet order finished. How oh, to build up the mining station? Yeah, the long-term strategy. Hopefully, I can offer. Or I can establish some good relationships with my neighbors. As far as I got the information, I have only one at the moment. And I didn't build any fleet till now. I have only my three starting ships. And I hope it's efficient. I will first start to build up a fleet if I have the covert assembly plant, which lowers the build cost for 10%. <coughs> and that could be a lot if we build only corvette for defense purposes. 
can lower the cost. Great. So, but how long it will take until my colony ship is ready? Oh, it's ready in three, two, one. Construction complete. Nice. So, great. Now I can expand my empire. Because we have here in the desert world. Colonize it. Here. And then my construction ship can directly move to the system. As system well. survey complete. So, first fleet reached. New system, barren world, desert world, great. But it's only a little desert world. And I can move further, come back, so that we did one round to the galaxy. Okay, they translated our language, that's really good. That's what I s that was my plan. Because I do not research the new languages directly, I wait until other factions translate it. And yeah, it worked. We have here another federation. Let's have a short look. Zero Gog, Federation. So you're a spiritualist and xenophobe. I have four planets and a population of 19. It's quite huge. So, survey system is completed. Construction complete. The governor leveled up. The governor here. No. Uh, give bonus to the output of slaves, but due to the fact that I'm a direct democracy, I do not have any slaves, and I uh, will not get one. So good for the level up and the trade, but it's not a benefit for me or for my strategy. Say it that way. So is the ocean world. I thought that there is anywhere another another desert world. Peace with me. Do we have this arid world? Do we have desert world here? So, but first let's have a look. We have to report. <coughs> great day for the syndicate. Surikata, Surikata. Okay, great. But I saw to see a GOG confederation. Is not that friendly to me. Lucky me. It's some systems ago. I think I will establish relationships. They are also pacifists with the Muran Accord. And establish an embassy. Because until I raise this of minus 118 then I prefer to get further information great this planet is named Dune okay it fits it's a desert planet great and I think my construction ship can it start 
to build mining stations. Yes, we can start building mining stations in the system. Plus four energy. That's worth to build a mining station. Mining station always come at a cost at one energy. And if we yeah spend one energy and getting four, it's plus three for us. It's really a good trade. So my fleet is moving. Empire is pumping. Then after this is finished, I will start to build a fleet just for defense purposes. Anomaly found. We have an anomaly. Then please research. It's a zero percent failure chance. It's a good trade. There's a planet which is close to me. And I have to think about. Now I have two options. I can invest some technology to have the possibility to build colonies on another planet than desert or I have a further look if there is any other possibility to find a desert planet we have here a despotic empire we have to find exactly what's okay we have on this side it's great I will also establish Embassy, because this is one of my core strategy to have good relationships with more than one empire. What are these planets? Are missions? Research complete. Situation log updated. How will it part my border range? To build some outposts get more territory under my control to get more minerals and other stuff so with upgrade I will wait till all fields have worker But it looks like that I only have one empire at this stage. As direct neighbor up to now. So, Dune is colonized in a few seconds. Situation log updated. Great. 
Great. Research complete. Build an engineering facility or research it to get more science. Just to slice in my empire. Yes, let's survey. Colony established. Due to the fact that this planet lies within. My border range, I will first survey this planet to get a bit more work for my construction ship. So, Dune is finished. Great. The next step will be to build. Food research plant. complete. Another research. Great. Power Hub is finished as well. And due to the fact that we want to start to build up our fleet, I think it makes sense to... No, all in general I will first upgrade research speed overall. That makes definitely more sense. First fleets coming home. They cycled the galaxy on the inner circle one time. Okay, Siroc. Those two empires. Difficult to bite them. Hmm. To an alliance, but no war is sufficient for me at the moment. I don't need them in an alliance. So, the strategy, due to the fact that I do not have any other desert planet. <coughs> Seen on this in the space. I will build a further colony ship. To colonize this planet with construction complete. Just directly beside. War was in the Empire range. <coughs> New diplomatic contact. Where are they? Those are. They are also pacifists. <coughs> Here, I can try. And I will establish an embassy as well as with the guys here above. Okay, I only can have four embassies. Wait until my relationships are getting better. So, to another planet. Great, we have here a desert world with 14, and we do have Tundra or Arctic. Then, oh, there was another one. Top world. Okay. Anomaly 
found. That's great. Thank you for the anomaly. Research. And then I will send my next colony ship to Anconus. It's not that great. I hate pirates. Hostile fleet detected. Yep, that's the point. I think I do have a problem. That's great. And my stage is under attack. Yep, that's not good. The station is lost. System survey complete. We'll have a look if I have to kill if I have to build to change design. new technologies to create a bit more powerful fleet No more construction ship can move. Rebuild the mining station. And I will export the 
these guys. So that it should be possible to defend it better. We we'll have the poor defense platform. Research complete. So we we'll wait for better tech. So I will research the power plant and hopefully it will have found. Uh, the strategic resources within my empire because this will give me a high rate of energy income. And uh, the plan is if you are creating some sectors, sectors are forwarding minerals to your let's say main empire, but they transfer they do not transfer the energy and therefore I want to create high energy producing planets which are completely under my control and I will build up some planets which only produce minerals which I will give the control to a sector commander they forward then 75% of the minerals to the main empire, but I do have uh, the whole income of energy. Uh, I do not know why it was created in that way, but from my point of view, this is uh, yeah, an easy way to build up some sectors and safe commanders so a spaceport is on another ship and then my fleet strength should be even with those of the pirates Construction complete. Have a look at the new home world or colony. And we are establishing our second colony. Oh, the elections. Plus ten percent minerals and things. Let's see what will happen. <laughs> That's quite funny. Uh, my third colony is named Sahara. Uh, I. Yeah, this <laughs> is funny. Um, because I, I do not know in which way these names are created. But uh, it's really funny that the second planet is named Dune the desert planet and the third one is named uh, Sahara and I only named the first planet it's my home world you only have the possibility so mm, do not know exactly but uh, yeah <laughs> it's, it's quite funny really so when will you like to be at first of July one month. So at the moment we are expanding our mineral outcome. Our energy production is at this stage very even. I can upgrade those plants to get 
more outcome, but at this stage it's sufficient. And I will build up here a power hub at the home world. Power hub runs 10% bonus. So we had a new election. Complete. Monthly influence plus one. That's great, and my outposts will cost minus 15%. That's great, so I will build some of them. Point defense. This is against incoming missiles. Colonies development speed plus 25% is not really necessary to never choose the basic combat roles. Oh my science should finish, sorry. Of the whole system? Really? Yes. Hostile fleet detected. And I do not have a leader here? Why? Possibly the leader died. Station under attack. Station under attack? Where? Oh, pirates back. Uh, great. But now we'll engage the pirates with my own fleet. And I will set construct ship to set up defense platforms. But I will set up these platforms after I have better technology res researched. Construction complete. Before my station is gone. Great, great. Probably now we'll build up some science labs. Too late. So I'll try to get this. here and we'll set up um, okay. um, to set up a defense platform beside that and then I directly have a clue how strong such a defense platform will be and if it's possible to build uh, a whole empire on such a um, defensive strategy. Yeah. That colony will be established. And I will make a break here. I will save the game. And yeah, hopefully see you again 
with the next session and hopefully we can set up more colonies and yeah we will fight against those space pirates so hopefully see you again and have a great day bye bye